Hey there, Larry Hickman here from Prosperity PPC, and thank you so much for checking out this video. First of all, if you're here because of a referral, a LinkedIn message, or you just stumbled onto this page, I want to thank you for being here. Now, at Prosperity PPC, we specialize in SERPRO marketing, and we've investigated hundreds of SERPRO accounts, and we've found that most SERPROs struggle in their marketing efforts, and most are wasting thousands on Google Ads. So we've created a process that helps you clarify results so that you can eliminate wasted ad spend and reliably grow your business. And whether you're currently using Google Ads or not, I'm here to share with you a simple two-part strategy to get more water damage and mold customers so you can keep your good employees in work. Because I imagine that you want to consistently have customers calling you so that you have predictable revenue to provide for your family and your team, right? Unfortunately, if you're struggling to know what results that your marketing efforts are producing, how do you know what to keep doing? You know, clarity is absolutely critical in making sound financial decisions about your business, and so I'm here to help, and I promise by the end of this video, you'll know exactly what you need to do. Now, I want you to imagine for a moment here that someone comes home and they find their kitchen flooded with water. How do they find your serve pro? Now, if they're like most people, what they're going to do is go out to Google, and they're going to do a search for something like water damage. They're going to be shown a couple different ads. Let's just say they click on your serve pro ad. They're taken to your website. They're shown your phone number, and they pick up the phone and make the phone call, right? It's a pretty simple and straightforward process. However, if it is so simple and straightforward, why do serve pros not know how many phone calls they got last month, right? How come I always hear this, hey, I spent $10,000 last month, but I don't know how many phone calls that I got. And what most SERP pros are missing is this thing called keyword call tracking. And that's the first part of our strategy uh, is implementing keyword call tracking. And how keyword call tracking works is it's pretty simple. It's you, when someone goes online and they type in water damage, a unique phone number is then put onto your web page that that person calls and it rings through your business same as normal. However, because it's tracked through that number, we track the keywords, the ads, the campaigns that it went to, the call duration, and we even record the phone call. And we are able to use that data to optimize the campaigns. And with that in mind, keyword call tracking is really how you target customers that are most interested in your services. When you know what is producing a qualified phone call, you know exactly where to direct the campaign budget towards, which are obviously the keywords that are actually turning a profit. However, without keyword call tracking, you're really flying blind. You really don't know where to spend your budget and what to show your ads for and what not to show your ads for. So that's the first thing. The second part of the strategy is adding in negative keywords. And negative keywords basically are terms and searches that you don't want your ads to show for. I'm going to show you an example here of a recent ads analysis that we did for this Serb Pro. There was a water damage campaign they were running. And some of the searches that they were seeing is iPhone 6 water damage repair, right? That cost that Serb Pro $25. PS4 water damage repair, another search, cost $89. Red line on iPhone 5 water damage, cost $30.61. Water damage car repair, $41, right? This stuff really starts to add up. And a couple examples, iPhone is a great negative keyword to have in your campaigns. Uh, if you had iPhone, these two searches wouldn't, your ads wouldn't have uh, shown for these two searches, and therefore, you wouldn't have got charged for those clicks. Same thing with PS4 or car. So you want to have those negative keywords into your campaigns and accounts. Otherwise, your ads are going to be shown. You're going to get clicks that aren't really relevant to your business. But not only does this waste your ad budget up front, it also leads to lower quality scores, which also leads to bid penalties. And as a result, you can pay up to 400% increased premium for every click in your account. Um, so you definitely want to avoid that because that's where it really starts adding up. So by adding negative keywords, I'm sure you can see that you can eliminate massive chunks of the ad budget. And of course, obviously, if you're tracking uh, through keyword call tracking, you'll know where to direct that ad budget to to produce you know, more qualified phone calls. That's the, sim the simple two-part strategy of how this works. But I want to share with you here a uh, customer journey so you can really see the proof uh, which is in the pudding here. So we performed a prosperity ads analysis for this Serpro on July 25th, 2018. And as you can see, they spent $4,260 and they got nine leads or an average cost per lead of $473, right? Pretty expensive lead. Um, in August, however, we began tracking phone calls and implementing negative keywords doing this strategy. And their overall cost went down to $3,038. And they got 22 leads or an average cost per lead of $138, right? That's a reduction in ad spend of $1,222 and double the phone calls. But it doesn't stop there. In September, we kept doing our optimization process. And after 60 days of optimization, we've seen 27 phone calls come in by while lowering their ads in by another $2,639. As you can tell here by their screenshot of their dashboard, this is $1621 is their overall cost. They got 27 phone calls or an average cost per lead of $60.05. So that's, again, 
three times more phone calls in September versus July, a 62% reduction in their ad spend, and an 87% lower cost per lead. So I want you to imagine for a moment that you are suddenly getting three times as many phone calls or a third of your ad budget, right? How would that impact your business? How would that impact, impact your revenue? How would that impact your personal finances, right? These are massive opportunities that are available in most SERPRO accounts that we see. Um, so again, it really needs, you need to look at this and really see what kind of impact these opportunities might have for you. Uh, the impact for this particular SERPRO obviously was 48 more water damage and mold calls while spending $3,861 less on their Google ads. So again, it comes down to what's hidden in your campaigns, right? That's the question you need to be asking yourself, and that's what we can help you identify. What's hidden in your campaigns? What opportunities are you not seeing? And at this point in time, you're going to have a choice of two paths, right? You can choose to close this window, and you'll still have to figure out where your next jobs are going to come from, and you'll remain unclear as to what results that you're getting from your Google Ads efforts and continue to waste thousands of dollars every month while your competition grows, or you can choose to click below and schedule your prosperity ads analysis, and we can help you identify your opportunities. We can help you eliminate that wasted ad spend and get more qualified water damage and mold calls while being found by your customers before they find your competition. So if you're ready to grow your SERP Pro and you're ready to go from being worried about where your next jobs will come from to knowing that you have a proven process and a system that'll consistently get you new customers every month, if you want to go from being stressed, if you'll be able to keep your good employees in work to retaining your good employees, if you want to go from wasting marketing budget and being unclear as to what results that you're getting for your Google Ads efforts to having absolute clarity, knowing down to the penny what return on investment your Google Ads are producing, click below to schedule your prosperity ads analysis. And, you know, we don't invite every SERP Pro to join us in Prosperity PPC, but if you are ready to take action on this now, I want to speak with you and see if it's a good fit. Normally, our prosperity ads analysis is an investment of $495, but because you've taken the time to watch this video, I'm going to pay for that analysis out of my own pocket. And this is just to show you how committed I am to helping you getting these results. Now, if you want three times the water damage and mold calls in half the time, book a call with me below and we'll prepare a prosperity ads analysis for your SERPRO. Thank you again for your time.